All right. Ordered myself something Monday at 6 a.m. from Lithuania. And it was delivered today around 2.40 a.m. to the U.S. Quite impressed with shipping. All right, time to open it. I'm going to partially open it and then resume the video. All right, here we go. Got myself an EAP 610 Outdoor Wi-Fi 6 Mata Wireless Access Point. I've been having my eye on one of these for quite some time. If I remember correctly, it says this thing can be submerged up to 30 minutes. I'm not going to try it, but, but yes. Here is the box. PoE adapter, power cord mounting kit, waterproof kit. Super excited to put this out in the shop and get rid of that 802.11n Netgear router. And just get a wireless access point out there. Because sometimes it gets a little moist out in the shop. All right, let's open her up. Okay, dokie. All right, it's kind of hard to hold the camera and do this at the same time, but it's got that new access point smell. All right, let's see what we get here. Installation guide. Pardon the squeaky chair. Power plug. Now this is, uh, of course, a uh, European power plug, but I'm going to use my switch with PoE, so it's not a big deal. If worst comes to worst, I'll just order a US one. Here is the mounting, or not the mounting hardware. Here is the waterproof seal equipment. Comes with some zip ties. I'm assuming this is for the PoE injector, if you want to mount it on the wall or something. And, uh... Here is the PoE adapter. Okay, so that is for the access point this is 48 volts at 0.5 amps some more mounting hardware Here is the access point. It's got a reset button, ground, 
and Ethernet. I'm excited to get this thing going. It's going to be a little bit. I'm going to go into a car show Saturday and I'm leaving Friday. So it'll be a bit before I get a video on this. Um, setting it up. But here it is. The unboxing of the EAP610 Outdoor. And this is, as of right now, still not available in the US. Alright. Techmaster170. Thanks for watching my unboxing video. Everyone have a good one.